everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a very helpful video for so many of you guys out there, whether you're shopping for yourself, which is totally okay, I've done it, <laughs> a friend or a family member. Today I'm gonna help you guys shop for the perfect Christmas gift for your loved one, friend, family member, whoever it may be. The first item I'm gonna share with you guys is a book and there's actually two that I wanna share with you guys. These are the deluxe books, the perfect book that covers everything magical, everything Harry Potter. I mean, they are insane. So this is the perfect book for somebody who loves Harry Potter and it is the art of Harry Potter. It is huge. It is beautiful, like look look how thick it is. And it is so heavy. And this book goes through so much detail. So in the first chapter, you can find things about the wizarding world, such as the Muggle World, Diagon Alley, Hogwarts Castle, the Hogwarts classrooms and offices, the grounds, all sorts of magical things like that. Chapter two is gonna talk about wizards, witches, and muggles. So you're gonna see Hogwarts students in here, Ghost of Hogwarts, the Dark Forces, the Triwizard Tournament, all sorts of magical things. In chapter three, you're gonna find magical creatures, companions, the Forbidden Forest, the Black Lake, creatures at Hogwarts, dragons, the working world, dark creatures, summoned guardians. Chapter four, you're gonna find Quidditch, brooms, the Sorcerer's Stone, Triwizard Tournament, dark objects, the Deathly Hallows, Horcruxes, wands, Hogwarts portraits, Weasley's wizard wheezes, which is just amazing and so vibrant, and wizarding inventions. Those are just a few. Okay, we have one more chapter actually. Chapter five is graphic art of the wizarding world. So we're gonna go through books and textbooks, school documents, potions, magazines and newspapers, the Ministry of Magic, blueprints, maps, Quidditch, food and drink, signage the troll tapestry and so much more like this book honestly just goes through everything and the illustrations are stunning and this book is by mark sumarak i'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce the name <gasps> the book is so heavy okay here we go here's the inside of the cover so this book is a hardcover book included with a dust jacket and i'm gonna pull up pricing for you guys i did research where you guys could purchase it and i was able to find it on amazon for 62 dollars and 22 cents and free shipping however because christmas is coming that's why i wanted to get this video up and it is black friday tomorrow i've noticed a lot of the books are almost going out of stock so if you want that book hurry up and go get it which leads me into the second must have huge deluxe Jamungo book and it is the Harry Potter page to screen book again large and beautiful and this book is by Bob McCabe it's the complete filmmaking journey so in part one they discuss the introduction and the making of Harry Potter setting the scenes you're gonna go through all seven films Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone the Chamber of Secrets Prisoner of Azkaban, The Goblet of Fire, The Order of the Phoenix, and The Half-Blood Prince, as well as The Deathly Hallows. So you're going to go through all the films and how they made them. Part two is about the art. So the characters, the locations, the creatures, how they managed to make everything look so magical. Part three is the epilogue. So the golden boards, acknowledgments, amazing. And honestly, you could get lost in this book and spend hours in it. It also talks really about like the characters and their lives before being casted for their roles, which I thought was really interesting. It's such a fun read. And this book also is running out quickly. I had to search three different places for it. Amazon is temporarily out of stock. However, they said they will ship when available. I did find it though. It is available at Books A Million. They still have it in stock for $75. So this is another one that is running out quickly for this Christmas season. So go find yourselves that book before they run out because those are gonna last a lifetime and they cover so much magical detail. The next item I have is a fun item. And if you guys are not following me on Instagram, head over and do so. It is Mindy Minx, just like my YouTube channel. This is a day at a time tear off calendar. And every morning I start off the day by tearing off one of these and you guys absolutely love it. This is a perfect gift to put either on your desk or just keep it at home, which I do. And I love it. It's a fun way to start the day. Sometimes they have little quotes about the movie. And 
and it's just so cute. It's an adorable way to start off the day. You can find these on Amazon for $8.99. The next items I'm gonna talk about, I'm gonna show you two items from the Noble Collection, but it is the Noble Collection. I will link that website down below for you guys. And the item is the magical egg or the golden egg. And this is what it looks like. So these are gonna be more of prop replicas for your super Harry Potter fan. And they're beautiful. It comes in a, with a stand, so it will sit up straight. On the Noble Collection site, you can find many prep replicas, including that one, which are more pricey items, I would say. The Golden Egg is $69, but they also have items like this, which I had mentioned would be absolutely perfect for somebody who wants a cute Harry Potter gift, but you don't want to spend a lot of money or you can't afford to spend a lot of money. This is the perfect thing to get them because it's a replica. It's cute. Is it a replica? I'm not even sure. Anyways, guys, it's Hedwig sitting on her books or Harry's books, and it's just a cute gift to get somebody. It looks nice, and it's magical, and it's a good keepsake. Ha! Oh, you can get them on Amazon, actually. On Amazon, the Noble Collection Harry Potter Magical Creatures, it is $29.99. You can also purchase them at Hot Topic for $29.52. Walmart also might have them. Barnes and Noble. I just found out a bunch of places have them. And the Noble Collection site does sell them. And they are $29.99. So the price is pretty much the same everywhere you go. So you can search these. They are called Magical Creatures. The next items I actually purchased from the Wizarding World, but you can find them online. You can go to Universal Studios Orlando's website, which is what I did, and you can purchase plushies. So these are perfect gifts to get somebody, especially a little kid or a big kid like myself that just loves stuffed animals and collecting. So we're going to start off with the little baby pygmy puff. She is $14.95. Crookshanks which is Hermione's cat, is $24.95. And the super large plush pygmy puff is $34.95. Perfect, soft, cuddly, snuggly gifts. The next item, okay. The next item is a keychain. These are perfect to get anybody. They're small, they'll fit in your purse. You can put your keys on them, obviously. And this was $10.90. It is the sorting hat and I found this at Hot Topic. Hot Topic has so many amazing Wizarding World items. They have a huge line for the new movie that just came out, The Crimes of Grindelwald, and what else do they have? Everything. They just have everything. So go check out Hot Topic to pick up a quick gift. Also, from the Noble Collection or the Universal Studios website, you can also purchase wands, which would be really fun for somebody to open up a magical wand on Christmas Day. This one is Luna Lovegood's wand. They come in beautiful cases just like this. Inside, you get a map as well. One side is going to be Diagon Alley. The other side is going to be Hogsmeade. And these are just fun gift ideas to get somebody. The next items I'm going to talk about are from Walmart. And they are the Hallmark ornaments. I'm not sure if you can get them somewhere else. No, it looks like it's only at Walmart. The two that I have are the Sorting Hat and the Niffler, and they're adorable. So they're little ornaments. I'm actually not gonna take them out of their boxes and hang them on the tree. I'm using them like as collecting purposes, but it would be a cute gift idea to get somebody if they did want to decorate a tree with Harry Potter ornaments. This is perfect. And these are, they weren't that much. It doesn't say on the box, but I know it wasn't super expensive. I'm not sure. The next items from Walmart are the dolls, and they were all the rage not that long ago. Everybody was talking about them, and this one is Harry Potter. The next one, Ronald Weasley, Minerva McGonagall, which is one of my favorites. She is probably my favorite. Is this Jenny or Hermione? This is Ginny, Hermione, and we have Dumbledore. These are the full size Harry Potter dolls, so check those out as well. Oh, I forgot to tell you how much they were. They're affordable also, which is quite helpful. Oh, there they are. The dolls are $20.97, and you can get them with two-day shipping at Walmart. The next 
are books that I want to show you. And this is because the new movie Crimes of Grindelwald just came out, plus Fantastic Beasts. All that is coming out now because of the movie. And this is a book that I found that would be fun to get somebody. It is the Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. J.K. Rowling, illustrated by Olivia Lamanek Gill. I hope I'm pronouncing her name right. Another really fun book. The creatures in it are amazing. So you have every single magical creature in here, or should I say fantastic beast. And I'm just going to flip through the pages and show you guys a few of them. We have Bow Truckle and all the other fantastic beasts in this book. This book you can find. Oh my God. I just discovered they have just come out with a new Fantastic Beast and where to find them. A new book that's coming out, guys, this year because Newt Scamander has discovered some more Fantastic Beasts. Oh my god, it's coming out later. Is it already out? I haven't seen this. What is this? This cover? Am I crazy? Are they lying to me? I'm not really sure. Okay, let me show you guys because this is a lot different. It might be already out. It's already out. I've not seen that one. Okay, so here's the book I have, and then here is the book that they are showing online. It is completely different. I wonder if it has more creatures in it? I'm not sure. You guys can find this one at Barnes and & Noble, and I'm sure Amazon as well. So this book is $20.99. The next books I wanna share with you guys are the illustration books. I have the first three books of these. I purchased them like literally as soon as they came out. The last one I believe came out in October, I think, for The Prisoner of Azkaban. These books are beautiful. They're perfect to read to young children and just to keep it for yourself. And they're fun and they're illustrated. And I did just learn that Barnes & Noble just came out with the illustrated collection books one through three box set hardcover for $120. And they are currently in stock on the Barnes & Noble site and they probably do have them in stores. So I have them separately. It would probably be so exciting to have them in a book set, like in the cover, but I have all three. I have the first one here, second and the third one. And again, when you flip through the pages and look at all the illustration pictures, it just is so cozy and visually magical. <laughs> It's so visually magical and it just takes you back to Hogwarts and you really can get wrapped up in the story just by looking at the pictures. So that box set again is $120. And then the last two items I'm going to share with you guys for the perfect gift ideas are going to be box sets for all seven books. This is the first box set and as you can see we have Hogwarts and on the back you have Hogsmeade, and then I'm gonna take out the books just to show you guys the front covers of these. I believe you can find this at Target. I think that's where I saw it, but I'm sure you can find it at several other places. You can get this set on Amazon for $53. I'm sure you can find it other places as well. But this is what the first book looks like. The illustrations are beautiful on the covers. Chamber of Secrets. I love this one because you have the Ford Anglia flying into the Weasley's house. The Prisoner of Azkaban, Harry and his Patronus. Goblet of Fire, Harry succeeding and taking the golden egg from the dragon. Order of the Phoenix, where we learn all about Festrals. The Half-Blood Prince, one of the most intense movies of the series, in my opinion. And of course, The Deathly Hollows. <sighs> until the very end. So that is that book set. I love when they come out with the new book sets just because all the illustrations are so beautiful. I really don't think they're ever going to stop with designing new illustrations and coming out with new items with Harry Potter and the Fantastic Beast World, which I think is amazing. And then the last book set I have is the complete series. It's the J.K. Rowling Harry Potter book set by Brian Selznick. And when you lay these books down and you put them together, they make a complete scene. I'm going to show you guys the top of the bookcase where it kind of shows all the books lined together and then the image that it forms. That is what it looks like. 
Okay, so they sell it at Barnes & Noble for $61, books a million, $100. I'm not sure how true that is with the pricing, but that's what is coming up on my phone. So you guys might wanna shop around to get yourselves the best deal. The last item actually that I'm gonna share is clothing. So this is a sweater, it's a Gryffindor house sweater. And this was purchased at Universal Studios, but you can order your house sweaters through the Universal Studios website and they will ship to you. You can also find clothes at many other stores. I know Kohl's sells Harry Potter clothing, Hot Topic sells Harry Potter clothing. So the last and final item that I wanna mention is actually behind me and it is a hovering golden snitch and I'm mentioning it because I get asked literally at least once in every single video that I upload, where that snitch is from, it is from the Bradford Exchange. I'm not 100% sure on the price. I think it might be around $150. And yes, it really does hover and it does rotate. So it's actually like a magnetic field type thing. It's highly magnetic. Like if you move it, it will smack down on the plate. So <laughs> you kind of have to be careful with it and it's not a toy. So it is definitely a collectible item, but you can find it at the Bradford Exchange. <laughs> all right, guys. So that is all of the fun, magical items that I wanted to share with you guys. I thought it would be the perfect time to do so with tomorrow being Black Friday. With that being said, I want to wish you all a happy Thanksgiving to you and your families. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Bye. We're going to be watching the Macy's Day Parade. What's your favorite part about the Macy's Day Parade? Big balloons. The balloons? Mine's Santa. But then again, when I see Santa coming, I know the Macy's Day Parade is over and then I get sad. Really, I think it's just everything. I like all the balloons. I like everything. And the marching pants, but they don't show them up for us. No. Yeah. That's my favorite part. Big breakfast and the Macy's Day Parade. Oh, my shirt. Yes. Guys, look what my husband found me at a thrift store. Look how cute it is. Keep calm and carry a wand. How perfect is this shirt? Like, it's the best shirt I have ever seen. Again, another magical place to find fun things. The thrift store. You made a nest. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a super excited, excited video. Mm -hmm. Do I always say that? You say super excited. Ah, super exciting, like in almost all of my videos. Today is a su I gotta find a better word than super exciting. Although life is super exciting. Harry Potter is super exciting. A super magical video. Got any plans for that? Today's video is the speed. Today's video is gonna be the psh. All right. I like it. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be, <laughs> that seems so rehearsed, rehearsed, rehearsed. Nope. I don't know where we should start. I'm so weird. Where's the end axe? And these are more a prop rep, rep, those are more prep lepical prep lepical <laughs> So that are all that are all that are all that are all that'll do. Close it up.